and in our hearts, we are connected with both ourselves and our environment. When in our ego or in fear, we are separate from ourselves and others. My perspective, as we know ourselves better, the better we know ourselves, the better that we can embrace change in our world, the, the less we fear other people, the less we fear the change, uh, and the better we can embrace our own power. We live in a time where we know more about how computers work than we know about how we function as human beings. If we're going to have global change, it is going to start with you, with all of us within each of ourselves. When new ideas emerge and it's something that works, everybody follows that idea and they do it very quickly. And in this way, a new world is emerging right now. We're already in a new world. The world of the past no longer exists. We live in a stressful world today where we are affected by the climate, the society, by everything that is going on. And therefore, it's really important to listen to your inner voice. Self-knowledge is not something that comes naturally to most of us these days. We don't really know what we feel. We don't really know what we think because we have learned to surpass what we think and feel. We have learned to suppress that into parts of ourselves that become unconscious. As we follow the traditions of our most ancient and cherished spiritual understandings in terms of the relationship of the heart, thoughts, feelings, emotions, compassion, how we use those in our lives, the chemical equivalent of the compassion in our bodies, the chemical equivalent of the gratitude is what is awakened uh, through the emotional experiences that we have. We really want to support people in looking within and finding their true voice and their true meaning and therefore we can together create a better place. Finding our way back to who we really are, back to our genuine self, where the true potential, where our true strength where our true talents and our true power to really change this world lies. Compassion is when I'm doing things that are really good for me, that are really good for you, and I don't use you and you don't use me. So we all get a balance in our lives. The world has changed and we've got to change the way we live and the way we think. And one of the ways to do that is by honoring ourselves uh, with the truth. There is no way around it if you want to live a genuine life. You need to get to know yourself.